Colt's downhill wheel lineup is very, very nice. They're <laughs> <laughs> they're comparable to that. Okay, yeah, they're, <laughs> they're comparable, comparable they're just to money. They are money. They <laughs> are highly free rideable after the skin is gone and <laughs> very, very nice and grippy downhill wheels. Very controllable because they have such they have a smaller contact patch than other downhill wheels do. So they're not super hard to kick out when they have the skin on them, as like uh, you'd see with other wheels. And uh, my favorite ones are the Gamma Rays. They, uh, they're they very highly free rideable. They, I can't tell the difference between them and the Cerebrums. They uh, go with the sharp lip. These have a very distinctive hookup, and with the offset bearing placement, it's super easy to release. And these are super durable. All the Colt wheels in the downhill lineup are super durable. They're all the same shape and all the same, uh, not all the same urethane, but they all come in at 72 millimeters, 54 millimeter contact patch, and they have, and they uh, they spread of uh, they spread across like a wide, uh, uh, a st styles of riding like the different formulas, the different urethanes, the different duros, all have a different, uh, all different meaning, a different for a different style of rider like. The traction beams would be your go-to downhill wheel. If you're just straight downhilling, you don't want to do anything else, you're just going to throw those scrubs away. But they are also highly free rideable. The uh, death rays are really crisp when you get through the skin. They're really, really nice for free ride. Really grippy. You can downhill and free ride them after the skin is gone. And, uh, and then the gamma rays are my favorite because they're really nice when the skin is on them, but then they're, they're, they're an ultra slippery wheel after the skin is gone. Mistothane is my personal favorite for free ride, definitely. Um, the softer durometer and the shapes that they provide are very nice for both styles of riding if you're going faster or technical free ride. I like Cole Classics for a, more of a technical kind of free ride with the side set bearing placement and the uh, big lip. These have a really nice hookup as well and the small contact patch. These are really icy. These would be a really nice wheel for a uh, bigger rider that's trying to go big. Cerebrums are my favorite wheel in the lineup. Um, I like to skate directionally. I don't really find myself in switch too often, but I like wheels with a lot of grip and a lot of hookup. These are my favorite because they have a center set bearing placement, so they they're a little bit grippier than your average offset free rod, free rod wheel. And um, with the big contact patch and the uh, slidey mistothane mist urethane, these are these co these combine to be my favorite free rod wheel of all time. They have a very nice hook hook up and a very awesome release, and surprisingly durable. And they do leave some lines on the ground. In my mind, the creator is the funnest. Definitely. Would you agree with me, Tristan? Oh yeah. Yes. Okay. It is the funnest wheel in the lineup. This is because it is damn slippery. Okay. Coal creators are, in my mind, the funnest wheels in the lineup because they are the most slippery wheels that we have here today. They uh, they are actually the hardest ones we are we have here today. They sit at 83A and. Um, they're pretty damn slippery. I would compare them to a Bad Batch Swinger, if you've skated those. They, uh, but they have an unusual hookup, a surprising hookup. I would recommend these wheels for a lighter rider that has is finding trouble to slide further, or somebody that just wants to do technical free ride, like some 360s, no complies, shove it. Overall, Colt has just a distinctive hookup and a surprisingly long-lasting urethane. I would recommend these wheels and for all types of riders. There's the Colt Classics and the Colt Creators for the uh, more slippery side, and the uh, Cerebrums and the Gamma Rays for the more free ride, fast free ride, uh, directional sort of riding, and then the uh, Death Rays and the traction beams for more of a hands down sort of riding with the uh, drifts and just the speedy shit.
you can get your Colt wheels at Stokes Skateboards. I have seen that they have the largest selection of Colt wheels. They have both the downhills, downhill lineup and the uh, freeride lineup. And that's where I got my Colt wheels.